Well, uh, she really contacted every person I know, and then, and uh, over the a period of about a year, she just kept people, all my friends and acquaintances would say, you know, there's a script coming your way from uh, Sofia Coppola. And uh, I heard about it for months and months before it ever showed up. There was a lot of, uh, there was a tsunami effect. And then when it finally came, I got about 15 pages. I was overwhelmed that there was so much, you know. That, but it's, uh, it got a big build up, but it was okay. It's worked out really well. I like the movie a lot. It's my favorite movie. While shooting it, did you feel it had award potential? Did it have? <laughs> Did, did you feel it had a work potential from the beginning when you were shooting it? No. I didn't, but as soon as I saw it, I, I thought it was, I thought it was great. I didn't, you know, you don't, you don't think that way when you're making it. You're just hoping you can pull it off. You're, you're hoping you can make it work. And uh, I'd seen, you know, I didn't know anything about her. And I accidentally saw part of the Virgin Suicides on cable one night in the middle of the night. And I said, boy, that was good. What was that? And when I found out it was this girl that was supposed to be sending me the script, I got, I, I got, I was pleased. So um, I didn't, I didn't decide. Uh, we didn't think, it, I didn't think it was an award. I thought it was just, I thought it might just be good, you know. And it, when I saw it, I realized how good it was. It's really good. What's uh, most often lost in translation? Uh, that's a, that's a kind of a big question. Give me a minute on that. Um, well, let me just take a stab at something, you know. Um, the film business, if we talk about film, uh, they really made fantastic movies almost 100 years ago. Spectacular movies 100 years ago. Great, great classic movies 100 years ago. And uh, I think what gets lost in the translation is that that's all material that we need to look at and that filmmakers need to know in order to bring film to modern audiences that you have to know that stuff to see what's gone before. You have to know what they've done so you can do, so you can take it and use that, those methods in telling stories to the modern age. If you don't know that, I think it's just, it's just a little bit of a handicap in, in making movies. Because I think making movies is really hard. Oh, it's, I think it's it really, it, to me personally, it's, uh, I, I don't know. I, but I think it really is, it's a, an award for the movie. The movie really, without the movie, it's, you know, people like the movie a lot, you know, so they had to, they had to say thank you, because it is good. But for me, it's, uh, it means I, I picked a good one. You know, that's what it really does mean.